good morning. Hello to you again. My name is Tadas. I am Operational Marketing Manager at Teltonica Networks. I am with the company almost for three years now. And today I will be representing uh, the first industrial switch of Teltonica Networks. So at Teltonica, we cover these specific networking devices markets. We began with industrial cellular products, routers, more than 11 years ago. We learned our lessons. We gathered extremely valuable experience during that time from our customers, from you, from our partners, from business situations. But we at Teltonica Networks never stopped thinking and planning for the future. We are constantly looking for new opportunities both for us and of course for you, for our partners. And now we are entering an entirely new business segment. It is switches. So today I want to represent for you the first unmanaged industrial switch TSW100, which is compatible with both 802.3 AF and AT PoE standards. Like most of our devices, TSV100 has rugged aluminum housing and wide range of mounting options. And I will get in detail with other features in the next slides. So the first switch of Teltonica Networks TSV100 has 5 gigabit Ethernet ports and 4 of them PoE plus Ethernet ports, which are capable to power up the devices to 30 watts of power per single port. So in the total power budget is up to 120 watts of power. Like I mentioned before, TSV100 is compatible with two main standards of PoE, 802.3 AF and 802.3 AT. There are many devices which could be powered up by PoE switches, but the most common ones are VoIP phones, CCTV cameras, access points, or access control solutions. These devices require a small amount of power. Naturally, total power budget of the switch depends on power supply unit used. TSV100 is capable to develop up to 120 watts of power, but since the most applications require much less power, our standard power supply unit that you will find in the box will offer 60 watts total power budget. In the near future, we will be offering additional accessories that will allow you to have a maximum power budget available. Also, from our accessories now, you are able to order DIN rail or surface mounting kits for easy and more efficient installation, as TSW100 switch has the same mounting option as our other devices. As we have been producing industrial cellular routers for more than one decade, we gathered valuable experience in very different use cases and solutions that our partners, you and customers, implement our cellular devices. As PoE switches are extremely popular across CCTV deployment use cases, because the cameras need both data and power, but not too much of it, so PAE technology is an excellent solution. Here you can see how our ROOT X11 cellular router is providing data connection to four TSV100 switches, which then distribute the data connection and provide the power to 16 cameras. So using PoE switches can dramatically reduce solution deployment time and, of course, costs. Moreover, cameras can be as far as up to 100 meters from the switch itself. Another use case, common scenario, is to use PoE switches in general networking installations, such as the ones in the office environment. Offices are full of equipment that needs both power and data to function. To name few, we can distinguish VoIP phones, access points for wireless services, access control and surveillance solutions for physical security. The common thing with the offices is that with time, their setups change. 
the needs change and even technology itself changes. So with every new infrastructure change, network integrators don't need additional help from electricity installers to make sure new devices have power connection. This gives unmatched flexibility for network integrators to install necessary equipment quickly and without any additional cables other than Ethernet. So there are many PoE switches in the market However, our TSW100 developed closely monitoring the demand from our partners, from our customers. This means that the device has everything a PoE switch might need, including 802.3 AF and AT standards, and a total budget. In addition, it comes in a rugged aluminum housing and a wide array of mounting options for any application needed. So I hope you got a very good and constructive information from my side. Uh, Josh Solomon is asking, are there any PoE routers in the roadmap? Uh, as this uh, PoE uh, switches our the first product with PoE technology, we will gather experience and of course the quality is our top priority. So what I can say, yes, we are thinking about a router with PoE in the roadmap, but you know, we need to gather experience from your side, from our customers to have a concrete feedback. And then, you know, we can be able to provide a quality working product with no drawbacks, with no issues so that you, our partners could enjoy our progress, uh, not for one year, but for five or even sometimes for a decade. And this, uh, unma there's a question from Yuval, Grandma, hi Yuval again. <laughs> How you configure the switch? Can you limit the bandwidth on each uh, port? So this is uh, our first uh, switch, TSW100 is unmanaged switch, so you are not avail able to configure any of uh, these parameters on this switch as it is unmanaged. Uh, good morning, the one anonymous attendee is asking when it will be available. So uh, contact your sales guy, uh, contact Altonica if you don't have a salesperson uh, on our uh, webpage and we will get in touch with you or contact any partner in your country and it's already available so you can order with, uh, in our webpage as I mentioned you know or you can order with our partners in countries so you just google uh, what partner is in your country uh, there are tons of it and you can find some you know information uh, useful information from them and we are producing more and more of these switches because they are quite popular. Uh, about the pricing, <laughs> Yuval is asking what will be the price. So the pricing is given to our customer uh, each by case because we have a policy that we work only with uh, big customers who are able to work uh, in their country with big quantities we are not working with the end customers so you contact your sales guy or if you don't have it, such uh, give inquiry to our webpage and our sales guy will contact you and if you will need maybe just a, f a couple of devices he will provide information where are you able to find in a specific country or specific region And good morning again, Petro. So Petro is asking, will you have a four port managed equipment? So at the moment, uh, no, but in the future we are planning. And uh, Petro, again, I think you are asking if this device could be managed on our remote management system. So no, because it's a managed uh, switch. So it can be you know, added to remote management system because it's a managed switch, but Usually people are asking such question. A good question, thank you for that. Uh, 
And for the future, there are some questions about how to my colleague is answering, uh, like what type of accessories will you offer to support the new switch device, like PoE adapter? So at the moment, uh, in our standard package, there's 60 watts power budget, and then another with 120 watts power budget uh, and DIN rail power supply compatible with this uh, TSW device will be in the upcoming future, in short future. So we are just looking for, you know, quality ones that will be, you know, working perfectly with our devices. And uh, there was, I think, a, a question. Yeah, I see Matteo is asking, why don't you use different DC connectors as used in 100% of industrial switches on the market? So uh, we implemented this, our device as all our routers with four pin code uh, connector. And we will be offering for you also, you know, uh, an accessory that you will be able to easily to, uh, to have a connect uh, PSU in different situations. So just wait a couple of days and we will provide this information. And if you have, you know, your own uh, individual sales guy, so ask him about the connector and he will be able to provide this newest information for you directly as we are not uh, at the moment added it to, to on our webpage. So it's always a good, you know, thing to have your personal sales manager at Saltonica Networks because you can give a questions and we are all answering for you, you know, because here for you, to help for you, to understand, you know, to change some situations, to deliver the products and hopefully to make uh, good solutions and good sales driven in your country, in your region. And Moshe, hi Moshe, <laughs> again, I was working with Moshe for a couple of uh, years. So Moshe is asking, are you planning a manager switch? Yes, we are planning. I can say only that. We are thinking about the future and we are uh, surely planning to produce and develop a manage switch. So whatever you have, you know, what will be the best uh, product of yours in your country, which you can see the opportunities that you will be able to sell, let's say, managed switch. So give us a feedback to uh, us. How many ports do you need? Uh, which kind of ports, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So our R&D team can gather this whole information from your side, and then we can deliver the product you will mostly interested in. So. I'm very pleased that you are active and you are giving us uh, questions. Mm, I, uh, maybe I would like to read some more questions. My colleague, I, I hear that he's typing a lot because <laughs> uh, you are giving us uh, good questions. It's very nice from your side. As I, I want to remember uh, to highlight that yet again, all those questions will be on our webpage. So if we won't be able to answer all of them because now you are adding more and more questions, uh, definitely he won't be managed to answer all of them. So uh, in a couple of days, we will add them in our webpage. So whatever you will have free time, go to our website on our webinars, check old ones, maybe webinars if you missed some of them and check these questions on this webinar. Josh Solomon says, actually, yes, that's a good point. I managed uh, remote management stable capabilities with the switch would be amazing. Thank you for a feedback, Josh. So definitely we will consider and as our remote management system is growing day by day and its capabilities are growing more and more because you need more and more features. So we are also adding uh, new features to our remote management system. So uh, keep on track on our newsletters. Keep on uh, us uh, on you know on Twitter or on LinkedIn. Check us because there we work. Myself adding no new information there, so that we are thinking which will be you know more interesting for you 
so that you can get you know more ways to sell more solutions to provide our devices in your countries in your regions so thank you for your attention it was a perfect webinar for me i hope you enjoyed and let's see you in another webinars of teltonica networks have a lovely day and week bye